so I just got my nails done, my hair done. I bought a fragrance. You know how much I love fragrances. So I get to work. I'm doing my thing on the bed. <laughs> the next thing I know, bam, these men gush in. They drag me off the bed. I'm still in my laundry, off the bed, on the floor, down the stairs, into the street. <sighs> this hobo sees me and he throws me his blanket. I cringe because it's dirty, but I take it anyway. I mean, <laughs> it's the only form of covering that I had. They throw me at his feet, and all I'm hearing is bitch, slut, whore. They're slapping at me, spitting at me, kicking me. I turn around, and I look around, and these are those very same men that I service. I hear him mutter a few words, and as I came to, I look around again, and they're gone. Man, I thought I was either dreaming, or I was either high, or drunk from the night before. I finally got the courage to lift my chin up and look him into his eyes. Man, I was transfixed. I have never felt such genuine love, kindness from any man. <laughs> and for the first time in my life, I felt safe, you know? Really safe. I have endured your sorrows. I have experienced your struggles. I have encountered your temptations. I know your tears. I also have wept. The griefs that lie too deep to be breathed into any human ear, I know. Think not that you are desolate and forsaken. Through your pain, touch no responsive chord in any heart on earth. Look unto me and live. 